Hey YouTubers, um, today I have for you a cast iron scrubber. There's a lot of um, different recommendations on how to take care of your cast iron. Um, one of them is not to put soap in here and um, to always um, treat your pans. So, and I'll talk a little bit about this in this video. Um, let's first let's open, this is my little tiny guy that I use to make eggs. I'll talk about that in just a second. Let's open up the chain mail to see what it looks like. This is the letter that comes with it, instructions on um, how to take care of it. So let me first talk about how you um, treat cast iron. There's lots of different uh, philosophies on how you treat cast iron. Um, my simple thing is I wash with a baby soap, which I keep on my kitchen sink. Um, I'm now going to use this chain link uh, also. Um, I just don't use harsh chemicals and uh, no uh, like regular laundry or no uh, regular dish soap. And then um, I dry it. I put it on top of the, the stove. I let it come to a heat where there's no moisture left in the pan. And then I take it back to over the sink and I'll do a, a spray, uh, any type of oil spray over it. I'll put it back on the stove for a little bit. And then uh, just as I see the it's starting to steam, or uh, to bubble, I'll turn the heat off. And what this does is that, and you leave the pan on the stove. So as you do this, the pan cools, it sucks the oil and makes a nice uh, formation. You can see how that does that. Let's look at the chain mail. So here is the chain mail. And there is the ring uh, to, to hang it up on uh, when you're not using it. And what you do is you just put, this is, this is really meant so you can clean it without having to use anything. You just scrub your pan down, get it nice and clean, um, rinse it back off and do what I told you to do about um, preheat, preheating or they call it pre-seasoning. Um, like I said, there's lots of different ways to do that. This is my method. Um, if you have a really old piece that hasn't been taken care of, you'll have to go into more uh, detailed um, seasoning using um, like a Crisco and in the oven uh, a few times to get a nice sheen on it like this. But once you have a sheen on this and you take care of it, you should always have a sheen on here. And I hear a lot of people talking about, uh, oh, we can't cook eggs on this. I cook eggs on this all the time. This is my, my egg pan. Um, it perfectly fits an egg uh, or two eggs. I put two eggs in here. And uh, this goes right over a piece of toast. So it makes it perfect size. Please remember, uh, starting February 2018, I am doing a monthly drawing. Every subscription, comment, and like to YouTube, uh, and comments and likes to my WordPress blogs, which are the links are listed below, is an entry for the month that you put it into. At the end of the month, I will randomly pick somebody. It will be gift cards or a package sent to you of things I've reviewed or other cool things I find. Thanks for watching, and have a good day.